I'm here at this conference to talk about one of the most interesting cases in the British government's UFO files, the Calvin incident. This was a case where two hikers were out walking in Scotland and they saw a large diamond-shaped craft hovering um, a short distance above the ground. And they took some photographs, and then this object shot off to the horizon at incredible speed. Now, they contacted a national newspaper and the journalist uh, took the photos and was writing up a story. But then things got very interesting, and uh, effectively the whole story was, was killed. The photos disappeared. Uh, the hikers who had seen this object and taken the photographs never spoke out again and have, have never been traced. And for many years, there was a blown up copy, poster sized copy of the best photo on my office wall, on, on the office wall of the UFO project in the Ministry of Defense. And then when the Freedom of Information Act came in, one of the things that people were expecting and looking forward to was, well, we, we're going to see this photo that everyone's been talking about. And they didn't. It disappeared. And the Ministry of Defense said, we have no record of this photograph. What survived was a poor quality photocopy of a line drawing, a tiny little black and white thing. What was missing was the huge, full-size, color, spectacular image, the best UFO photograph ever taken. And the only UFO photograph ever taken that has survived a proper scientific analysis that declared this was a genuine image. There was no trickery. Uh, this was a real object, and, and it was big, and we in the Ministry of Defense did not know what this was.